Hi everyone, it's Mary Ann over at Mary's Place. We miss you all so much. We can't wait until we're all together again and we're able to spend time doing fun things. So I hope you're all staying well and you're healthy and you're enjoying this beautiful weather. It's not hot out yet, so it's time to get out there and just appreciate nature. So I have a little craft here that I'd like to share with you this afternoon and it's used with coffee filters. It's very, very simple. All you need to do is take a coffee filter and some markers. I've already started it, and I'm using five different colors on this particular one. You can see I've already marked it up. Doesn't need to be fancy at all. It can be messy. In fact, it's probably better if it is a little bit messy because you're gonna make the colors all come together. So I'm just gonna add a few more things right in the middle here. Let me add a little bit more yellow. And by the way, I'm doing this on a waterproof tablecloth. You're gonna to wanna to make sure it's definitely waterproof because you're gonna make this wet and we don't wanna soak it down into the table. So I'm gonna take a little spray bottle of water and I'm gonna spray it. You don't wanna get it too wet, but you wanna make it wet enough where the colors start running together. So that's good right there. Now, if you want, you can just leave it right there to dry. It'll probably take a good half hour, or you can put it outside in the sun, and that takes about five minutes. I've made one just a few minutes ago, and it came out looking like this. I made another one. It says, we miss you. And then what you can do once it's all dry like this, is you can scrunch it up, and you can take a clothespin. And if you wanna paint the clothespin, you can go ahead and do that. Put the clothespin right in the middle of it. And if you've got any pipe cleaners, you can glue the pipe cleaners onto the clothespin and you have a little butterfly, which is kind of nice because it's spring right now. So you'll have the butterfly in the house with you. So that's my little craft for today. And again, I hope you're doing well. We miss you all so much. And in a couple weeks, I'll have another activity for you. Stay well. Bye-bye.